This is a case study of patient 18 years of age with the complaint of pain and uh, PUO. This is the middle hepatic vein, this is the portal vein, this is the inferior vena cava in transfer section, this is the right lobe of the liver. This is the diaphragm, right hemi diaphragm. This is the kidney, right kidney. Now, if you just consider the, this is the uh, proximal ureter, this is the parenchyma of the uh, anterior parenchyma of the right kidney, the echogenicity is diffusely increased and uh, you can see a small amount of fluid, here it is, this, this line, this black area is, is, a, is a fluid between the liver and the kidney called the fluid in the hepatorenal angle. Now this uh, uh, patient is shivering while I am performing the ultrasound and uh, see that the ultrasound findings are, you see in this area, middle region of the uh, kidney, we see that uh, the capsule of the kidney is elevated. There is a breach uh, in this area. This is the, now this is the capsule at the lower pole. This is the capsule at the upper pole mid region and, the, and, and little mid region. Small. This area is regularly outlined internally cystic with internal Hypogenic areas with no calcification is suggestive of focal pyelonephritis or lobar nephronia. This is the right kidney. This is the upper pole of the right kidney. This is the lower pole of the right kidney. And this is the area which is uh, this area, which I am going to label as a cyst, shows a breach in the capsule of the anterior capsule, anterior mid capsule of the right kidney with uh, approximately measuring 31 into 25 millimeter irregularly outlined cystic area with internal lipos seen uh, in, this, in, this, in this region. So this is a case of uh, acute focal pyelonephritis or a or global nephronia. So you see, you see this case. Yeah, here again, you see. Let me focus the capsule. Now the, this is the anterior capsule, upper pole, anterior capsule, lower pole, and this is the area that we are seeing is. In, in place of this capsule which is showing a breach. And this is a case of uh, focal abscess, focal abscess at the anterior mid pole region and uh, anterior uh, parenchyma and, and uh, there is no capsule seen in this region. And uh, this is a case of uh, focal pyelonephritis slash abscess slash focal nephronia in the right kidney. This is the right kidney. This one, the upper pole of the right kidney, the lower pole of the right kidney. Okay. Now, let's see if there is any other finding associated with this one. Now, if you see that the corticomedullary differentiation is intact, So the, uh, the echogenicity of the parenchyma is diffused, erased. However, the 
you see this area. These are the medullary pyramids. They are intact. Cortico medullary differentiation is intact. Central sinus echo is normal. And this is the pathology that is uh, the cause of fever and uh, fever with rigors in this young boy. This is the ileosaurus muscle where the kidney glides. So this is a, a, a study of uh, kidney with uh, diffuse increased parenchymal liquidity with a breach in the uh, anterior mid capsule where uh, 35 into 31 millimeters approximately admiring L defined cystic area with internal echoes is seen which is consistent with either an abscess or focal pyelonephritis and uh, lobar nephronia. I am going to magnify this specific this area. This one. See the breach. The capsule. This is the anterior capsule, lower core. This is the upper core capsule, and this is the region of uh, pathology in the kidney, in the anterior mid region, where you see a breach between the this capsule. We don't see a capsule in this region. Better see there. What is the status measure of the left kidney. Let's see that. Now you see that this kidney also shows diffuse increased parenchymal lipogenicity, minimal hydronephrosis. Is there this in this area shows minimal hydronephrosis, minimal dilation of the calyces. There is diffuse increased parenchymal echogenicity of the kidney and the kidney is ten point five into four point six centimeter is normal in dimension. And this is a in a case uh, that these are the medallion. This is the medal. This is the cortex. Cortico medullary differentiation is intact. There is no breach in the capsule. So this is the left kidney, Sidiojo, which shows changes of acute pyelonephritis. Uh, this is the urinary bladder. The transfer section is an almost uh, partially filled. There is the urinary bladder is normal, no calculus is seen. So this is a case of pyelo acute pyelonephritis with an area of uh, abscess in the anterior mid region of the Right kidney. This is the liver showing diffuse increase, decreased parenchyma lipogenicity as minor portal vein radicals are very prominent. This is the gallbladder which is normal. Thank you very much.